Yeah, I thought that group uh, got into the ball, challenged shots. Um, they're they're hard to guard. They can spread you out pretty good. So you have to get back. You got to get set. You got to fly around. And you got to be connected. And so I I knew this game would be a challenge coming off the road the way we did, and uh, just find a way to win. And that's what we did. Yeah, and we needed it. So I think both guys hit timely buckets. You know, Deuce was terrific uh, defensively because he's chasing Thomas around, and, and Thomas is a load to deal with. And then Dante, you know, that may have been his best game. You know, just uh, timely baskets, big big plays, hustle plays defensively. Um, Josh, same thing, tough plays, rebounding. You know, they were pounding us pretty good on the board to early on. And so um, just getting that energy into the game was huge. It's yeah, just situational. Like I thought the physicality, you know, was what we needed. And, and so that's the only reason why we, we did that. But whoever's got it going, that's where we're going. You know, some nights it's not your night. It's someone else's night. And uh, put the team first, everyone's sacrifice. And that's really what we've done all year. Yeah, it says a lot about him, and I, you know, I love the mental toughness of our team, the 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 ability to persevere through things when things aren't going our way, just keep going, and then make it go our way, and then in the end, find a way to win. Whatever it is that we got to do, that's that's what we have to do, and uh, you know, it's a credit to them. That's the makeup of these guys and their willingness to commit to play for for the team first and put everything they have into it. It says a lot about them. Uh, no, and that's you know that's one of the things. Obviously, we don't want anyone getting injured. That's, but it's part of the game. And then whoever that next guy is, whether you get into the rotation or your role may get expanded, maybe it's more minutes, maybe it's more opportunity. Uh, I think it gives that player a chance to grow. And you know, I think Dante's shown that. I think Josh has been phenomenal. I, I you just can't say enough about all the intangibles that Josh brings to our team. And then for Deuce to be doing what he's doing is credit to him. And, you know, and, and uh, like the thing I loved about Jalen tonight, he just kept going, you know, like he had some tough breaks, shot, some shots went in and out, just, but he, he kept going. And, uh, you know, that, that's the type of mental toughness that we need to have. Pretty high. <laughs> right next to physical toughness. No, but seriously, that it, it's, I think that's important. The the makeup of the player, you know, the so the the toughness aspect in it's mental and physical. It's the ability to think on your feet. It's your willingness to put everything you have into each and every day. Uh, and I think that when you look at the characteristics of players that improve. I think they exhibit those qualities. And so uh, I think and obviously talent's a big part of that, but the, the intangibles, what drives achievement right, and what drives improvement, I think it's important to look for those things. Yeah, just, you know, and look, I, I have a lot of confidence in Precious. He's done a great job for us. I love the fact that he can play two positions. I think he can guard multiple positions. You, it allows you to do a lot of switching. Uh, and so it was more the matchup of, okay, who are we looking at? In the Golden State game, we're looking at Curry. And then, you know, the, with with uh, Brooklyn, you're, you're looking at Cam Thomas has been rolling. Bridges is, is a load to deal with. Cam Johnson spreads you out. Uh, Finney Smith is, you know, a, a guy that you got to pay attention to. 
and Claxton is very unique as well. And then, you know, when you look at Schroeder and his, the speed that he plays with, and then Dennis Smith uh, Jr. has really turned into a very, very good player. Like his defense and his energy and his toughness and his ability to attack the rim are really, really good. I'm, I'm, I'm happy for him because he's a great kid. Well, he's well rested. <laughs> no, it's <laughs> no, no. I, you know, it, it, and the thing is, you, I, there's nothing that you don't love about Deuce. You know, like, and from the moment we drafted him, and even when he wasn't playing, that tells you a lot, because the way he worked, you know, a guy's work ethic is a big part of it too, his drive. So. He had that, I think, the toughness. The, I mean, the guy was a big-time football player. Those guys are tough guys. And he's, he's strong. He's got great feet. He's got great anticipation. He doesn't quit on a play. Um, so the defense has been there from day one. And then I think the offense was always pretty good. He's always, he's always been a scorer. But he's, he's gotten to the point where he's just a knockdown shooter now. Like, you cannot leave him open. He's... And the numbers bear it out, whether it's practice or, or games. And so it's a credit to him. He's in phenomenal shape. He stays in phenomenal shape. He takes care of himself. So he, I think he has the ability to do it. How important or maybe even comforting is it for you that Isaiah healthy again, hopefully, and not only doing what he does off the glass, but scoring? Yeah, it's huge. He's moving great in the way he's playing. It's, you know, the rim protection, the pressure on the rim, the playmaking, uh, playing out of the pocket, uh, I think is huge for us. I think he's feeling better and better, uh, and he adds a lot to our team. So um, it opens up the floor for us because you're playing five out. You know, he's flashing up to the elbow, and we're playing off that. So I think he's he's playing at a really high level. This is as, as well as he moved since the beginning of the year when he was – grabbing 20 rebounds a night.